Thank you for joining me again. My name's Tracy. I've got back from work and I quickly popped in Poundland. Uh, I can show you what I've picked up. It's, it's a bit of Poundland. It's a bit of Holland and Barrett. I had to think where I went. Holland and Barrett. And then I also popped into Aldi as well. So straight after work. So let me just have a quick drink. And let's get into it. My first item. I picked the bag up. I thought the bag looked lovely. Shop till you drop. Thought <laughs> it so pretty. Very florally and reusable. So in my bag, my haul isn't very big. So it, it's not a big haul, but it, it, it's, it's some, some items, but I wanted to share them with you. Uh, I don't know if you remember, in my last haul I did pick some sugar lip rub for, for my mum's Christmas Eve box. So, and there was one in raspberry, I can't remember what the other one was, so I picked one up for myself this time. So. Two set lip kits, so it's a sugar lip rub with coconut oil and cocoa butter. And then to moisturize, you have to put a lip mask on, so that'd be quite interesting. What else did I get? Oh, I picked some of this Palmer's Natural Fusion Chai Seed and Argan Oil Hair Mask. I love putting things on my hair. I usually use the Asian hair oil, so this will be something different and it's always nice to give it a go. So, yeah, make you feel lovely. What else have I got in my bag of goodies? Uh, oh, I picked this up. EOS Ultra Hydration Body Lotion. The bottle, 350 ml, so the bottle's quite big for one pound. And obviously it's really sealed well, so I'm going to give that one a go and see if it's any good. The scent is Vanilla Orchid. So I love vanilla, vanilla is my favorite. Body lotion and perfumes as well. I'm, I'm a vanilla girl all the way. I'll put these, I'll put two of these up. The finish fresheners for your fridge. Well, I put them in my fridge to be fair. They're for your dishwasher. And it takes out all the nasty smells. So I picked two of them up. I've never had a problem with them. Pick some blue tag cup. Running out. Some things are quite random. I, I like these um, confetti balloons. I mean, got no parties coming up, but they're, it's always nice to have a few balloons lying around in the house. I don't know when you might use them to like decorate and celebrate anything. And they were only a pound for a pack of 10 silver foil and it's they're quite clear and they're so pretty and then i bought these i love febreze and i bought the bathroom air freshener in this is a limited edition spice apple and vanilla cookie. But I won't be putting these in my bathroom. These will go straight in my drawers. And I don't really buy the sachets as much as what I would buy these bathroom air fresh. Clothes smell amazing. A drawer, you can even smell your drawer and it'll woof out. So 
I recommend you to try them, see what you think. They're for the bathroom, but I don't tend to use mine for the bathroom. I've also picked up some more refill hand wash for a pound. And how many mils is there? 500 mil, and it's a nice reusable. I always try and stick to these to be fair and always refill my bottles so I'm not wasting too much plastic. So we're all doing the same. My bag's getting empty now. There's not much in there. Uh, I've also picked up some, oh, some nose pore strips. That's quite boring and London tea tree and witch hazel nose pore strips it removes your dirt and oil and blackheads and helps to unclog any pores. So, really good. Use. I'll try and use that twice a month. And I've also picked up some. One for the eyes, two lipsticks, a rimmel in Naughty Nude. Let me just show you. I mean, if you went to Superdrop, they'll be like $7.99 or $6.99, but for a pound, if I just open it up for you so I can show you what colour. Uh, I bought the Naughty Nude one. Colours I would use, especially with my skin, my skin tone. So if you have that sort of skin tone like me, you might like it. Oh, that's a lovely colour. So that's the first one I picked up, and then I've picked up Models Own. I mean, they usually retail about six, seven. 99 so to pick it up for a pound it's a bargain we all like to have a bargain this color is amazing look at that and that is in the shade deep plum and number 18 deep plum Them up. And then I never know how to pronounce this. Bon Josh. Bon Josh. You'll have to comment down below and let me know if I've said it right or wrong. <laughs> but yeah, so I'll pick that up. It's for the eye, so it's an eyeshadow. Let's have a little. Look. all my oh no okay. one more item I picked up this uh, this is new in, in my homeland I've, I've not seen this before it's lavender pillow spray it says for a good night's sleep I don't know if you're one of those people but at the minute I find it very very hard to sleep and I'm always up at the same time and then I just cannot get back to sleep and when I do, it's time to get up for work. So, I'm a bit out of routine. So, if I open that up for you, smell it. 
I'll do a smell test for you. So bottle, bottle's quite nice and simple. It's quite. the lavender in that. So I'm going to give that a little bit of a go. So there we go. So hopefully I might get a good night's sleep. And the other two things that I bought and I also popped into Holland and Barrett's. I picked up my two favourite products that I get from there when I've run out. So if I show you my first one, it's cleansing oil. And it's called, it's from Su Sukin Super Greens. So it's for, I would recommend this, it's better than any, Elemis. And it's obviously the fraction of the price. It's got no fragrance in there. I suffer with mild case of acne and eczema. So I try not to have a lot of fragrance on my face and it does help. It has helped me a great deal. So I always try and look into things that are better for my skin and obviously anything that's a bit more natural. So that's to wipe my makeup off. And then I've obviously got a detoxing facial scrub and it's all paraben free and it's so cute. Uh, this, this was 9.99. I know it's a bit pricey for facial scrub, but believe me, a little bit goes a long way. I don't use a lot of it. I only do a face, face scrub once a month because it's not meant to be good to use it all the time. And it does say for normal to dry skin types. But the little beads, I don't know if you call them little beads, they're ever so fine so it won't be very harsh on your skin either so it'll be all very subtle. So you're not really rubbing into it but I definitely recommend this. That is from Holland and Barrett. So this was 9 99 and this is, I think it's roughly about the same price. I can't, I can't remember all the prices now. I can't remember, I don't know where my receipts have gone. But yeah, about 9 99 and 9 99 So from Holland and Barrett's. And then I've also picked up, I popped into Aldi and I've just, just thought I'd randomly show you. Bought some sliders for 6 something like what you'd see in River Island. Definitely a fraction of the price. As you know, I'm a bargain girl. I'd rather pay less than more. Like they say, less is more. And I have, for the longest time, been looking for a night game. Because I'm not very tall, I'm only 5'4". I, want, I didn't want a long night game. And, Everywhere in Primark, in Matterland, they're all long at the minute. I don't know if it's, they've just thought of the tall girls, but I forgot about the short ones. But I picked this up. I haven't opened it. And it's the softest material. It's something that you'd find in Marks and Spencers, like one of their range in their materials. But I've got the size eight to 10, and it's got a hood. And it's like a beige spot, like beigey spotty. So it must have been in their new super buy, the super buy aisle, whatever it's called. So, yeah, this will be the right size for me. And then the last thing that I have picked up. Is a luxury feel like cashmere throw and when I mean they broke luxury feel it does feel like it's the softest fur out it's in like a pale grey which goes with my city just bring it a bit closer to show you and it is machine washable you say super soft 150 times 200 centimetres. So, and that will be big enough. And I'm afraid 
that's my haul for today. I uh, hope you found it interesting. Please comment down below if you like anything and take care and God bless you. Till next time, see you soon. Bye.